Vote on Libya. The internationally recognised government in Tripoli is cutting nearly $30 billion from its 2020 budget due to an oil blockade. Finance Minister Faraj Bumtari said the cuts wouldn't impact what he called sensitive areas like health and education. Forces loyal to the warlord Khalifa Haftar have blockaded several major ports and oil facilities since mid-January. Just a quick word on this with Mahmoud Abdul Wahid, our correspondent in Tripoli. Tell us about impact, Mahmoud, how bad things already are economically for people in Libya and then what uh, this cut in budget could do. Well, Kamal, apparently it's getting worse. And the finance minister here today in this uh, press conference in Tripoli is another is raising another alarm uh, uh, warning of uh, uh, what the Siraj, the UN-backed prime minister, warned of before about uh, an imminent catastrophic financial crisis in case the oil blockade continues. As you know, Kamal, that the minister mentioned that they're cutting uh, the uh, 2020 uh, uh, budget to 40 billion dinars, which is about 28 28 billion dollars. This is a major drop in the budget, as we have been noticing during the past years. It was uh, over than that, but because of the oil blockade, the, con the uh, continuous oil blockade by forces loyal to the warlord Khalifa Hefter, it seems that many people are going to pay the price, especially as you know, Kamal, that oil revenues are the backbone of Libya's national income. It mm. represents about 40 uh, excuse me, 94 percent of the country's uh, uh, gross uh, domestic production. And about one third of the population in Libya rely mainly on salaries from the government. And the minister today is warning that uh, there are people who uh, might not be able to receive their salaries because the uh, uh, Central Bank of Libya is not responding to the uh, minister's uh, multiple requests of uh, dispersing these uh, salaries. Now, the central bank is not uh, stating any response, but we know that the uh, uh, chairman of the central bank of Libya uh, said before that they do not have liquidity to pay uh, the salaries. As I said, that the oil production has dropped dramatically over the past two months because of the oil blockade imposed by forces loyal to the warlord Khalifa Haftar on the oil terminals and installations in the east of the country. And the oil production dropped dramatically from 1.2 million barrels a day to only 120,000 barrels a day. And the losses, according to the state oil firm, the National Oil Corporation, is estimated at around more than two billion dollars mm. total losses because of the oil blockade. Kamal. Mahmoud Abdul Wahid in Tripoli, thank you for that.